this is your spine. And so the bones in the back are the bones that you can feel when you touch the back of your neck. This is the back of your head, and this is the spine from the front. So beneath your swallowing tube, the esophagus, you have the vertebral bodies of the spine, the bones, and then you have the discs, the shock absorbers. And these are the vertebral arteries, and these are the cervical nerves that come out the side. Now, the spinal column is really a functional unit for the spinal cord to go down the spinal canal. So when patients have the spinal cord pinched or nerves pinched coming out the side, nerves pinched patients get cervical radiculopathy or shooting pain down the arms. When patients have a pinched spinal cord, they get cervical myelopathy. And that's a problem that they have with the spinal cord performing its basic function of giving strength to the arms and legs. So a lot of times one of the early symptoms patients will say, I have difficulty buttoning buttons. So the procedures to unpinch the spinal cord or the cervical nerve roots can include a cervical discectomy and fusion, a cervical laminectomy where you're opening up a window, unroofing the spinal cord, and a posterior cervical fusion where you put little screws in here to stabilize the spine. So at the Endoscopic Spine Institute in New York, what we're able to do is go in with a little scope the size of a number two pencil and unpinch the nerves that go out the side and if need be, remove some of this roof of the bone to unpinch the spinal cord, all without a fusion and all with restoring the normal cervical anatomy, decompressing the cord, decompressing the nerves, all without a fusion, just through a Band-Aid incision. So spine surgery has changed, right? This is a very complicated three-dimensional structure, but think of it just as a little tunnel for the spinal cord, right? There's a, the overpass and then there's the floor or the road and you're going through this tunnel. So we're able to open up that tunnel just by doing surgery with a scope in the back to unpinch the nerves on the side and the spinal cord in the middle.